He may be short, he may be shy, but there's something about Abdel Fattah el-Sisi that appeals to the female Egyptian heart. Well, he has such a charming personality. The way he talks, the way he wants to convey a message. Not since the presidency of Gamal Abdel Nasser has another Egyptian succeeded in eliciting such powerful emotions amongst Egyptians. There's something about Fateh al-Sisi, a fascination of sorts, something that has elevated him to iconic status. Outside polling stations, this has been a common scene. The former army chief has revived an interest in men in uniform for men in power. Some women cite his modesty. He will definitely make a difference and we need someone like him. Things will get better. It will take time and will be a gradual process. He has experience and will definitely look out for us. The other candidates don't have military experience and we need someone like him to protect us. But al Sisi has also played to this gallery. Listen to some of his campaign speeches. The words housewives, mothers and sisters are bound to come up. Alongside some of the traditional phrases of Egyptian romance, such as, you're the light of my eyes. Little wonder then, many women see this man as their man. Uh, he has nice, uh, good um, um, vision for the coming era, also for the woman. So I think he might uh, bring uh, 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 good stability for uh, ladies. The first of all, he's a leader. He looks like a leader. He knows what he's talking about. He knows the responsibility. He feels it. He, uh, he knows how big the country is, how much the country is actually needing um, a lot of work. Not everyone is convinced Al Sisi is the answer to women's problems. Right activists question his commitment to women's rights. That he has appeals to Egyptian women is not in doubt, but it's not clear whether this is a romance to last or a convenient fleeing. Wabat Nagelo, CCTV, Cairo, Egypt.